page 66 in chapter 6. Yes? Who threw that? Who oh that? I don't know. Why are you looking over here? You came from over there. There's nobody over there. Well, well obviously you sure? came from over there. Well, what's going on? That's not the first time it happened this morning. Yeah, yeah. but I start flickering, sir. Yeah, remember when the TV turned on all by itself? Just open up your book. What's going on? I don't oh, want that. Right. I, I heard some stories about this room being audited. Is it true? No, just, just yeah. open up your book. It's mad. Then how did that happen? Open up your books to page one of mine. Oh, uh, why, Mister? How come you don't tell us about that story? They're not the only ones I want to know. I think the whole class is supposed to know. Oh, all right. Well, I had a friend my freshman year named Eddie Velasquez. He was my classmate in freshman year, and we were friends. He was kind of nerdy, but... Well, the football players didn't really like him. They would bully him. And one day in class, they were bullying him. I was too scared to help him, so I just walked away. They hit him in the temple, and he died. Sorry, sir. What they do with the body and what does that have to do with this room? This is where he died and this is where they kept the body all summer. They realized what they did, so they put his body in here. It was the only door that was open. And they left him here the whole summer. Sorry what happened, mister. He was your friend, why'd you run away? You probably hate to know he's gonna haunt you. You suck. <laughs> <laughs> Oops! You're gonna fall in your room. You did. Have you seen paranormal activity? You're gonna probably get that. Worse because like he that. was your friend. This is Philip, boy, I needed you. I was in great danger. And you left me. We were friends. You should have done something. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, Eddie, but I didn't want to get involved. I was scared. Yeah, I'm just done. You lived your life, so now it's time for me to live mine.